The Earth and Mission Science Division is a group of European Space Agency (ESA) mission scientists, research fellows, young graduates, contractors and administrative staff working at the within the science, applications and climate department of the Directorate of Earth Observation Programs. The division is located at ESA's European Space Research and Technology Center in Nordvek, South Holland, the Netherlands. Topic. Introduction The Earth and Mission Science Division MSD supports the preparation, development and operations of research and operational missions within the Earth Observation Programs Directorate. The division is responsible for ensuring the application of scientific and other user community requirements in all phases of the development of Earth observation missions, from precursor studies through to in-orbit satellite operations, and for ensuring coherence throughout with the objectives expressed in the mission requirements documents, including the management of mission, instrument-specific, or ad hoc advisory structures as required. In support of the preparation of new mission concepts, or development and operations of each ESA-approved Earth observation mission, the division conceives, initiates and conducts supporting scientific studies in-house and external to ensure that the mission is «fit for purpose». In addition, the division organizes, coordinates and executes campaigns for the purpose of acquiring airborne, balloon-borne, or in-situ data. Campaigns are specifically designed in support of technology or mission concept development, mission development, data simulation, and instrument calibration or product validation purposes. Campaign data are distributed publicly. <laughs> <laughs> mission Science Division Management The Mission Science Division Management Team are Dr. Mark R. Drinkwater, Head of Mission Science Division, One. Dr. Roger Hagmans, Head of Earth Surfaces and Interior Section. Dr. Malcolm Davidson, Head of Campaigns Section. Drive. Torsten Fair, Head of Atmospheric Section. Topic: Research Missions. The Earth and Mission Science Division has prepared and contributed to the approval of eight ESA Earth Explorers, two, with two fast-track mission candidates to be selected from proposals to the 2016 call for the ninth Earth Explorer mission, and three new candidates selected from proposals to the 2017 call for core Earth Explorer mission ideas, namely <laughs> Earth Explorer core missions GOCE launched successfully on the 17th of March 2009 successfully completed its mission on the 13th of November 2013 3 Eolus launched successfully on the 22nd of August 2018 4 Earthcare 5 Biomassa call for proposals for Earth Explorer 10 EE10 core mission ideas was released in September 2017 Three candidate ideas were selected for Phase 0 pre-feasibility study in September 2018 STEREOID Enhanced Radar for Earth, Ocean, Ice, and Land Dynamics Daedalus G-Class <laughs> Earth Explorer Opportunity Missions CRYOSAT-2 launched successfully on the 8th of April 2010. SMOS launched successfully on the 2nd of November 2009. Swarm launched successfully on the 22nd of November 2013. Flex Fluorescence Explorer asterisk selected in November 2015. Topic: Earth Explorer Fast Track Missions. A call for proposals for new Earth Explorer mission EE9 concepts released in November 2015 6 resulted in no candidate being selected, and a revised call for proposals was released in December 2016 7. Two competing candidates were selected for Phase A, B1 study in November 2017. Forum Far Infrared Outgoing Radiation Understanding and Monitoring 
skim sea surface kinematics multiscale monitoring topic operational earth watch missions The division currently supports the development of seven series of approved Copernicus program Sentinel missions as part of the space component of the joint EC-ESA Copernicus initiative. It has supported the development of METOP, and is currently active in supporting the preparation of METOP second generation. <laughs> Copernicus space component missions Sentinel-1 Sentinel launched successfully on 3 April 2014 and Sentinel-1B on 25 April 2016 Sentinel-2 Sentinel-2A launched successfully on 23 June 2015 and 7 March 2017 Sentinel-3 Sentinel-3A launched successfully on 16 February 2016 and Sentinel-3B launched scheduled in April 2018 10. Sentinel-4 on Meteosar third generation S. Sentinel-5 precursor launched successfully on the 13th of October 2017-11. Sentinel-5 on Metop second generation Metop SG. Sentinel-6 also known as Jason continuity of service Jason CS in preparation for the second generation of Copernicus Copernicus 2.0 six high priority candidate expansion. Missions are being studied by ESA to address EU policy and gaps in user needs, and to increase the current capabilities of the Copernicus space component. Anthropogenic CO2 emissions monitoring CO2M. High spatio-temporal land surface temperature LSTM. Copernicus hyperspectral imaging mission for the environment CHIME. Polar imaging microwave radiometer CIMR. Polar Ice and Snow Topography P-ice. Radar Observing System for Europe, L-band SAR Rose L. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Meteorological Satellite Series. The division also presently supports the development of several instruments out of the 10 instrument payload of the approved series of second generation METOP satellites. The METOP SG series is developed in cooperation with EUMETSAT, as part of the EUMETSAT Polar System Second Generation Initiative. EPSSG represents Europe's contribution to the future Joint Polar System JPS. MWS microwave sounder, to provide atmospheric temperature and humidity profiles. SCA scatterometer to provide ocean surface wind vectors and land surface soil moisture. RO radio occultation sounder to provide atmospheric temperature and humidity profiles as well as information about the ionosphere. MWI microwave imager to provide precipitation monitoring as well as sea ice extent information. ICI ice and cloud imager to measure cloud ice water path properties and altitude. 3MI multi-viewing, multi-channel, multi-polarization imager, to provide information on atmospheric aerosols. UVNS, S5 ultraviolet, visible, near-infrared, short-wave infrared spectrometer Sentinel-5 instrument, to monitor various trace gases, air quality and support climate monitoring. <laughs> External links For more information, see Official website of the European Space Agency ESA. Webpage of the Living Planet Programme of the European Space Agency Webpage of the Earth Explorer missions Campaigns page of the Mission Science Division Campaigns blog <laughs>